And the happy clown would be, I've just had the worst day of my life. And the fire is, I love you so much. <laughs> I need to apologize with some guys from class. You're being a clown. Talking head. The first one is the skull emoji. The skull, I know what that is. That is so simple. That is, this bottle is poisonous. It has poison in it. So you don't want to drink out of it. That's what the skull emoji means. You would think that's what it's about, but that is not what it's about. They've completely changed it. Well, how about, I don't have an outfit to wear for Halloween because I never, do Halloween outfits, but that's the first thing that comes to my mind because I need to get something to wear, mask. No? It's, it's not uh, negative. It's pretty positive. That means that you got a new hairdo, a really good hairdo. Your skull is rocking it. Whatever's on your skull is rocking it. That means smiley face? I think I it means think smiley. I think you know this. It means happy? Like what? Skull yes, means I'm happy. so like, happy. I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> Yeah, so if someone's like really, really but you're funny, dead with like, laughter. Yes, I'm dead. So that's why you put the skull. The clown one. Oh, all right. So if the skull meant I'm literally dying with laughter, then the happy clown would be, I've just had the worst day of my life and I want to go hide in my bed and cry all night long. That's what the clown face is. How close was I? You're the right, but it's negative. It's a negative thing. The happy clown is okay. negative, Laura. The skull is positive. You get it? Now, Gen Z's, I don't know. No, no. Um, okay, so the happy clown fit. Tears of a clown, you know, Smokey Robinson, those tears of a clown when there's no one around. So it means I am crying over a guy that I like because he doesn't like me. That's a happy clown face, but I'm really crying inside. You would use it when someone's being like very like foolish or making like embarrassing themselves. Like, oh, like that's kind of like you're, you're being a clown right now. Like, like um, you would you would comment on someone's video when they're being like very embarrassing, very foolish, very like someone's acting like a clown, put that clown emoji. The first one shows how happy I am. And, well, I'm pleased. I'm pleased with something. And then the fires. I love you so much. I, I'm just burning with fire and passion about what I'm trying to tell you. This is really important. You gotta listen to me. And I need help with my, from my fellow colleagues here because I'm sure this is not anything like what you expect it to be. Let's focus on, on the smiley face. Does oh, okay. anyone want help? Yeah, help I think me. that's the awkward smiley face, right? That's oh. when you're awkward. So to me, I used to use those smiley faces to Mayura and then you told me that's being awkward. <laughs> that's an awkward smile. Oh, interesting. Yeah. It's like, it's not a false smile. Just when you look at it, they could either be like secretly planning to murder you or they could just be like, and then the fire one. The fire one is like, go off. It's like, like if someone posts a really good picture, you put the fire emoji to hype them up. Yeah, like your right. fire. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I or see like, that a lot on Instagram. Mm -hmm. Someone posts uh, a picture and it's like heart, heart, heart and fire, 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 or just fire. Okay, the first one, someone who's, okay, I would use this when I'm really, begging for something i'm crying but i'm begging to you i mean it has two different meanings like it can be used that way but it can also be like i'm crying of laughter <laughs> more commonly it's when something's really funny yeah but it's still used when you're sad but yeah 
But there's an emoji for that. When something's really funny, there's an emoji. Like, right, yeah, right. the two the two things. That's very yeah. That's very boomer emoji. You oh, guys just you guys just don't want to agree. It's the same emoji. We we don't tear up so much when we when we're happy. We just like have drops droplets of tears. You know. But like when you're you're laughing so much, you're like crying and laughing. That's what we would put. When Wait, my so grandma just passed away, they put that emoji, and I was like, why, why are you laughing? It's crying in pain. The emoji is like <laughs> it's in pain. <laughs> That's just the way it was. Oh, you boomer, I will never forget. I will never forgive you for that. <laughs> okay, the, the next one. <laughs> mm, the hot, okay, I think... This is the, hot flash. You are really, but you are exhausted. Going through menopause. No. <laughs> Somehow, I don't think that generation would be using that. No. <laughs> we, we, we don't no, have they'll be using it for us. <laughs> yeah. it's, something, it's something spicy, something. This, I mean, this is when you find someone hot. When you find someone really attractive, you put that. Okay. <laughs> oh, Not the fire emoji? <laughs> Isn't that interesting? Okay, you need to you need to take care with that emoji because I use it all when I say oh, I'm really tired. I've been working all day, so <laughs> I need to quit using that emoji. <laughs> Whoever you're texting that, you're telling them that they're hot. <laughs> you might as well go back and talk to them if they're acting weird with you. Now you know why. <laughs> I need to apologize with some guys from class later <laughs> to say I'm, I'm really tired okay so the first one is like it's like this hand which says and it seems like a crying face so i'm gonna say my first my only guess is don't hurt me back off or you piss the hell out of me back off no no is it's it like, is it like help oh. what it's like talking hand. Just, just stop talking to me. Okay. Yeah. Don't talk to me. Stop. Or you could use it like, oh, please, like, please. Mm. What? Is you know? Yeah. This one. This one is very fluctuating within context. Mm. Okay. Okay. The next one is pretty, pretty self-explanatory. Yeah. The twinkly eyes, like pouty face. Mm -hmm. Howdy face, like don't. Yeah. Yeah. Like, like, yeah, like yeah. puppy face, like yeah. don't mm -hmm. don't. It's like I'll send you a cute picture of a, like a really cute puppy, and you'll put like you'll put that. Ah. Uh, it's instead of saying oh how cute, yeah. you put that emoji. Mm -hmm. exactly. And then you could also you could use this while like if you're begging for something from someone, you go please. I yeah. see. Puppy eyes, yeah. Mm -hmm. Awesome. And now the final round we have, mm -hmm. I think that's sus, right? I'm just thinking, oh my, I can see everything you're doing. So don't put, don't <clears throat> put, pull the wool over my eyes. I can see everything you're doing. Kind of side-eyeing someone. You could, you could use it differently. You could say like, I'm giving you side-eye or it's like more like surprise eyes and you're like, Kind of looking at someone like, what was that? Party time! <laughs> was it cool? <laughs> no, this one is negative. Oh. Gosh. Everything's the opposite. I know. So if you smile, that means yeah. you're pissed off. And if yeah. you if you're well, sad and crying, that, that means, means you're, you're happy. The person on earth. Hmm. Right. Boy. So if some young man asks you to marry them, and you start, and you oh God, the mixed messages. <laughs> Oh, I give up. You tell me. I think you guys told me this was awkward or something. Mm hmm. Awkward? This, is, this was kind of like uh, a spin off of the clown one. 
it's it's very like awkward very what just happened it's a fake smile essentially yeah mm -hmm. it could be used as like the fake smile with a little smile as well you can put that who decide all these meanings i mean it's <laughs> I, these clearly two, not us these two young ladies obviously are yeah <laughs> So it's very sussed me. <laughs> yeah. So if I see skull emojis and my kids text, I don't have to worry about it. Uh -huh. That's all I, I know. <laughs> and tell us the last one. What the stars and what stars? And you're a superstar. Uh, reach for the stars. Okay. So you put you, a word in between those stars. Mm -hmm. You put a word in between those stars? So I would be typing something out and there would be like maybe a word or a couple words in between those two stars. So and in quotes, would... in quotes. Yeah. So I don't like, mean what I'm saying. Like many Allah knows. <laughs> something when you want to, for example, if you want to tell a friend that she's really nice, it's so like an exclamation or, or you're beautiful with stars. Not quite. So it's that's the opposite also? Like no. <laughs> Okay, give us an example. The one with the examples that I gave to the Uh well that was over it. Um Um Like Gen Z would like make a joke about like depression to be completely honest with you. <laughs> They'd be like, I have, I have depression, or I'm super sad, and depressed. Like those would be in between the the lines, the stars. So that means super, over. Well, you put the stars to 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 mean the opposite of what you're saying. You, you put the I stars, and it it kind of gives emphasis to the word, where it's like very sing songy, and you make it very like jokey and self deprecating kind of thing. But are you depressed or no? No. <laughs> so, yeah. So, I am in the story depressed, but I'm not depressed. No, I think this one is this one is very hard to explain. It is hard to explain. Uh, for example, I'm, I'm ready to commit suicide, star. Uh, so, is that a happy thing or a sad thing? Uh, it's no, don't funny put because people have texted that. To, to tell your friend that you're not being serious, you're, you're joking. It's like, okay, exactly. I'm not to suicide, no, but you put the stars so your friend knows that you just need, um, you know, ice cream and, uh, uh, you know, Netflix. <laughs> I would, uh, yeah, I would use it like that, exactly. Why can't you just tell them you want to go for ice cream? Right! Why? <laughs> but you put the stars so your friend just understands that you need, you know, a girl, girl evening. So, party time. I need a party time because I'm gonna kill myself. Stars. <laughs> <laughs>